Hey folks, it's Ardwolf. Welcome. We are on episode 35 of our playthrough of Hearts of Iron 3 as Germany as we continue our campaign in the East against the Soviet Union. Um, while screwing around here, uh, I noticed that we've got an entire stack here that's basically ready to go and for some reason is sitting around with no orders. So let's fix that. Move them up there. And these guys as well should be moved up. So this is the uh, 20th Army Corps. Well, actually, these guys all have orders. These guys now all have orders. And we've got a whole bunch of movement happening in various places on the line here. Um, we, we've made some pretty significant progress in the last two episodes, I think. And the Bulgarians, uh, Hungarians? Hungarians? Hungarians. Um, have actually started making some moves as well. The Romanians are busy collapsing, so I'm not entirely sure what's up with that, but all their, all their shit is in retreat. So, this is what happens when they didn't do what I told them to do. So, but if nothing else, we're tying down some stuff down here, so that's all good. So let's start the clock. I'm going to go up to speed three here. And what do we got here? What are these guys doing? Nothing. Let's fix that. Uh, but these guys are busy retreating, so actually let's... Uh, Cancel that. Sounds like a good idea. And looking at what else we have on the line here. Uh, we're pulling out of this. That's not really okay. Let's look at the infrastructure map mode. That's why this is a uh, too low for infrastructure, so we don't actually have to worry about that. We're about to close this pocket. Won that battle. Yeah, I think that's pretty much all okay. Now, we have no battles happening right now, which is not really okay at all. Uh, but that's because we won all of the previous battles. So, there's that. Now, what do, we, what do I got for timer on this? 20 hours. And this guy's... time here. 9 May tomorrow. Okay. This all works. And we're actually comfortably, we're going to actually compress this front a little bit, which is great. At least temporarily. All right, major Soviet counteroffensives here. This one will need to be looked at. This one will need to be looked at. 
This one will need to be... Jesus Christ, look at this. This one I don't care too much about. Alright, so looking at... Uh, at this guy here. This is in Costapol, which is right here. Um, okay, so that is as good as it's going to get. Alright, we got this going on here, so let's get some air support in here. This guy. Let's reinforce that a bit. Get some air in there. Is it right here? Hmm. Are they about yeah, this whole thing pinned down? Alright, well, since we have Alright, so attack, attack, attack those. Hit this as well. These guys are on the cooldown. What's the timer look like on that? 50 hours. Yeah, we got some reinforcements. Here's an infantry division. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. That's okay, actually. Um, we'll take, uh, this guy, let's see here, where's the, and he's got armies up under him, so we have to look at the individual cores here, that's one, two, uh, let's take a look at it this way, so I really need another core here, but let's, uh, Let's select the right unit first of all, create a new core, and this is going to be the 31st Army Corps, and let's try and attach him somewhere, attach him to the 5th Army, which is not really where he wants to be, but that's where he is, so that's where he'll stay. Let's move this up a bit. What do we get going on up here? These guys are off the timer. This guy, unfortunately, is not in great shape. And if I attack here right now, I'm going to have a big armor disadvantage. So I really have to wait for this guy to show up back here and roll him back down. And that's going to take a bit. So we got that moving. A lot of guys moving. Let's kick that in there. Move these guys up here. And we've got some Panzers here. Let's uh, remove these two who are on cooldown and hit right there. Let's get some air support in here. Let's take a look at the air map mode here. We need to start thinking about now 
of like this, for example. Do air superiority and a radius. That works. Run that continuously. Okay, that's right here. We knew that was coming. Right? It's not. Where is it? Kremen something or other. So, it's right here, right? Somewhere? Oh, here it is. Okay, so we can hit that. Uh, this is already attacking, though. So, let's see what we have here. We do have a light panzer division there. But it is already committed. Move that HQ up a bit. Move this HQ up a bit. Move this HQ up a bit. And let's get some attacks, some, some serious attacks going here. One, two, three. Now let's look here. That's the one I want. Medium Panzer Division there. What we got here, we've got uh, these two. Hit that. Overrunning this Soviet air base will be very useful. This guy's doing nothing right now, so we'll hit that. These guys are all defending, so we can't really do anything there. Uh, okay, that's working. Let's look at this stack. Uh, we do have... Let's uh, pull out, first of all, anybody who's already committed. Um, and then a bunch of the infantry. Roll that there. That should be pretty forceful attack there. Won this battle. Where was this? Is Lock now? Right here. Okay, good. We're pushing him back there. Pushing him back here as well. And what do I got here? Move these up. And this is about to flip as well. What do I got here? We have some light panzers. Let's select that. Push that back there. So these look pretty favorable. Take another look at the air map mode. Make sure I'm getting coverage. I'm not. So we need to get some... Let's see here. These interceptors need to rebase here. All right, and then we will pause while we hit this on air superiority. I'm happy with that. And of course they go to no order, so let's now do it again. Good. Okay, everything's looking pretty good here. Uh, we've won these battles. These guys have no orders right now. Uh, these guys are retreating. So what do we got here? Can I do that? I can, so I will. 
this unit can certainly move up from where it is now. That guy's moving up. Take a look at our progress up here. There's a much more secure front now than it was. And let's hit that with that, and this with this, and that's going to be a pretty uh, high-powered attack right there. Uh, we need some tactical air support for that. So we'll return him. Alright, that's better. They're pulling back already. They didn't even uh, they didn't even give chase up there. So these are moving up here. So we can hit this and this. Actually, no, we don't want to do that. Um actually yeah we do. Okay, so these guys are all moving here. To, I'm not even going to try and name these fucking provinces at this point. These guys can attack this. These guys can attack that. And let's leave that for now. Give it a couple more hours here. We won that battle. We have units available. Excellent. We will put this in a Panzer Corps, wherever we see. That's right here. Well, we'll, it, we'll figure it out. And that's right here. So let's... Okay. Move these two units here for now. Get them into the fight a little bit. All right, these guys are retreating, so we're going to move those down here, and we're going to move, remove two of these, move one, uh, these three. Oh, wait a minute. No, 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 no. I'm good with that. Move that there. Move that there. Uh, these guys should be it moving. These guys are on a cool down for 13 hours. So we lost that wherever it was. We're going to take this province, and since the Hungarians and Romanians are not doing anything, and I'd like to give the Romanians a chance to take back their territory here, let them concentrate on that for a bit. Arrival time, 12 May, that's today. Arrival time, 14 May, a couple days on that. Alright, let's get... some tactical bomber action here, where the battle is not going terribly well. Slovakia accepted our request to produce two Messerschmitts. Okay, that's nice. I don't remember requesting that personally, but okay. So I can only assume that there's like Russian air here. Uh, that's like Slovak air, I think. Alright, so things are looking pretty good up here. Let's take a look at this core. Uh... All right, so we want to take this 31st Army Corps and its guy and move him up. He's in pretty bad shape uh, organization-wise, but that's okay. Just to check I'm not leaving a hole here, I'm not. <clears throat> okay, this battle's going pretty well, but let's get some... Uh, this wasn't supposed to be an actual battle. We'll hit this here. 
the ground attack for a couple days. Okay. These guys have zero hours, so let's give it an hour. Alright, and now we can hit that there. And that there, and that from there. This is uh, Kernauti. Uh, we have acquired a uh, advance in special forces. Ooh, that went down actually. Now it went back up. Alright, this is super irritating that these keep coming off. And that's that battle. All HQs. This infantry division can move up to some place less useless. And we can start... Oh, that's already attacking there, so that works. Let's see what we can do up here. I'm fairly confident that we will manage. Move that up. Move that up. Some infantry will be helpful. Leave that alone. See what else we have here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna have to rummage through these. All right, so this unit is 4.33, so we can safely make that attack. And then I want to hold back the Panzer Division so we can make that attack. Let's check the infrastructure mode here. Now, oddly enough, I'm in a place with terrible infrastructure. So don't ask me how that's supposed to work. Move that back. All right, make sure all these guys are busy. They're not. Um, you know what? Hold on a second here. So, these guys are just on cooldown. So this whole group can be brought up. So let's take one of the Light Panzer Divisions. And move these units here. And then we will suck out these guys. Move them here. And then the rest... Well, let's give them a couple hours to actually register. Let's look at that in a moment. We'll move this bunch up here. And then let's look at this. This is Eukmergy, something like that. Now that's a big problem, too. Um, there. We'll take the rest of these. These guys are already moving in. Take that guy off. Put this here. Furthermore, we'll knock a couple of these off. Put them attacking that as well. Put that there. Move this. They're already attacking. Ok, 
Okay. Two days looks sufficient on that. Alright, so all this stuff is looking pretty good. That's okay, I've got some more guys headed that way. But we're retreating. Fantastic. These guys are going to arrive when? Alright, so how are we doing down here? Uh, they are now moving into Kernaudi. This looks good, but ground attack. Can give them an order here. Crap. I didn't mean to do that. Go back to air map mode here. Not quite that big. That's not necessary. That looks good. Okay, we've been attacked, we've, but we won. Uh, what I'm looking for are the close air support guys to support us here. Here. It looks like the Soviets haven't made any more serious progress up there. Tina. Where is that? We do have some support happening here. These units are attacking Riga. That is not looking like an effective attack to me. I'm going to cancel that battle for now. These guys are moving as the rest of these pull back, so we'll be able to launch a new attack up here fairly soon. We won that battle. Alright, let's take a look at what we can do here. Uh, we've got some... Well, what do we got here, actually? I see no reason not to... Well, there's that. Yeah, that's a problem. Alright, that's fine. So we'll take this whole stack and most of that stack. It's available. Let's put that in the 31st Army Corps. And let's make sure everybody else is busy. So let's take this stack for example. They're doing nothing. are all on the move. Make sure these are all HQs. They should be. Move that up there. I may have to reallocate some of this business. Move that here. These guys are busy retreating. Oops. And that battle's going pretty well. And we can do some more stuff up north. So let's do it. Do it. What we got here? And 
and these guys are all moving in. Everything looks pretty good. Okay, so let's take a quick uh, fix on this. 99% officer ratio, which is not good. Take a look at uh, Leningrad, which is going nowhere. Uh, take a look down at the Romanian area, which is not going particularly well. Zoom all the way out and go take a look at Vladivostok, which I keep calling Sevastopol. Um, so it looks like the Japanese may be about to take that. Let's take a quick look at UK 60. So that actually has gone up a little bit. Not entirely sure why, but it has. Uh, this may have gone up a little bit too, though that's almost certainly due to me. Let me look at victory points real quick. Uh, yeah, okay, so if the Japanese drive all the way up here to Yakutsk, or whatever this place is, um, then they'll get some more points, but I don't care at that point. If they take Vladivostok, I'll be perfectly happy. And they keep them, you know, keep something going on down here, I'll be pretty happy. Going down here to political mode. So they've managed to isolate this now, so that's looking a lot better take a quick look at what the Japanese are doing in India. Uh, they have pushed a little bit ahead here. We won that battle, we won that battle. Alright, so it is 10, 11 a.m. on May 15th, 1941, and we have completed yet another episode of Hearts of Iron 3. So I want to thank you for watching. I would love it if you would subscribe to the channel or spread the, the good news about the channel uh, around to your social media circles. And uh, please leave me a comment in the notes below. So I will see you next time. Thanks again.